Uh, have you ever had a problem and yeah. you decided, you know what? On this, I yep. it's too tough for me to make. Yep, we yeah. learned that might be the way to go. There's a new study, as published in the journal PLOS Biology, it shows that deeper sleep can lead to eureka moments. Aha! I got it. I figured it out. I was trying to think Give of a moment eureka. that I've had, and I I can't think that I've had. Oh, I've got it. That's yes. that's it. After right. I've had it, like figured a deep it sleep. out. Yeah, but have you had that before? I'm sure. I'm sure. I can't. I if I am tired at nighttime, I can't think for anything. <laughs> Good luck. I can't. True. I always I always sleep on. I'm like I will be so much better in the morning. Now I have friends that will sleep with a diary or a journal next to their yeah. bed, so that way if they yeah, do yeah, wake yeah. up in the middle of the night, they Run will down. write something down. Do you guys do that at all? Or? No. I should. I should. <laughs> all kinds of ideas that are missed. Opportunities that oh are missed here. Oh my gosh, think could about how great we could all be <laughs> if we actually had notebooks right next to us. Uh, this is kind of interesting. So what they did was they looked at uh, 90 different people and they asked them to track dots on a screen, okay? They tricked them though, and they didn't know this. It's supposed to be a simple exercise, but they left out on purpose one of the instructions. So it made it a lot harder to do. So then they had people do this. They said, go take a nap. Go take a nap. We're going to hook up some stuff to your brain. We're going to track your sleep and then come back and try it again. Yeah. When they tried it again, the people who went into deep sleep, they got it. They figured out the instructions mm. and then they did and they completed the task. The deep sleep. Studies? Psychologists. Yeah, I have a friend who was, she is a psychology professor now. She was my roommate in college. And they, I did all kinds of weird experiments. What? Like <laughs> describing like what dreams you had. I don't even honestly know what she like what her study was about because they trick you all the time. So you had no idea. No, because she can't, she can't tell me because then that taints the, yeah. what the the um, experiment should be. It's like if you're actually taking medicine or if you're taking A the placebo, placebo and exactly. you don't know. You right. just have to look yeah. for the best apparently. But I mean, we know this. We know sleep is that it's a it's function that we all need. Right, and then it gets the toxins out of your body. It helps you sort of reset. Mm -hmm. But what's interesting here is that just 20 minutes of deep sleep can really help. How often have we heard, don't make any financial decisions or tough decisions at night or when you're really, really, yeah. really tired? Yeah. Or even drowsy driving? Drowsy yeah, driving, sure. Point. Just as dangerous. It's the same thing. Yeah. So if you get that deep sleep, like you said, yeah. it can actually help you when it comes to your decision-making ability or having those, aha, yep. great Scott, eureka moments. I would argue showers are also good for those eureka good moments, point. right? We you, have you not tested that theory. Think and process. Yeah. Who, who's going to do this shower study? Someone. What? Yeah. Okay. Power nap, people. Power nap. Power nap. We'll do the You're nap first. so smart. Yeah.